Yeah. It's Gary, so you can come to my house on my bear cave. Um, what I'm going to do today is show you how to plant your own garlic. So this is what I did to get it look like this, is I found garlic clove from outside my fridge. And what we did is we look for little green leaves or on it or any type of greenness in the middle. Or you can find a regular garlic clove, set it in some water, let it set for a couple days, you're going to notice little green leaves will start to grow on it. This right here, it's probably about three, maybe four days worth of growing. It's already gotten this tall. So what you do, you can take them straight from just regular garlic cloves, put it into the dirt, or you can put them in the water and start growing the roots on them and growing the leaves itself, and then plant them. But either way, you're gonna have fresh garlic for yourself. It's good to have fresh garlic in your home that you grow on your own for the fact that you can put it on steaks, put it on chicken, put it in pastas, put it on anything that you have. You can put it in sauce just for extra spice to it. And it's also good for your heart, good for your blood pressure. Um, so what you want to do is you want to get good soil. You want to make sure it's loose soil, not too too tight, too clumped up. If you have any clumps, just go in by hand, break them apart. Uh, get a good area. What I'm using today is, is this type of bucket since I'm an apartment prepper. I don't have a yard or my own yard or an own garden to, to grow it in, so I'm going to use something like this. What you want to do is make sure, like I said, have good loose soil. You want to wet it down a little bit. Just a little bit of water. So once you get a good area, nice moist area, not muddy like, just nice and nice and moist. Get down probably about two and a half, three inches into the dirt. And then start laying out your the garlic and do it. So what you do is you take your garlic with the green, the leaf side up, and just place them in the dirt. You do want to place them a little bit away from each other, not too close to each other. So like this will be good. So once you got your garlic in there, you can throw a little bit of extra water on it, just to wet around it, which I like to do. You don't have to, and then start putting your dirt around it. So after you get it put in there, you can water it down one more time. Make sure it's all good and moist. You might want to water them like every three to four days. Keep an eye on them. Um, once these leaves start turning brown is when it's good to go ahead and start digging up your, your garlic. By the time these start turning brown, you're going to notice you have from that one garlic clove, you have pretty pretty good sized chunks of, chunks of garlic in there. Um, during certain times of year, good to, good to the start start planting them. Say around um, after your first your first frost, they say is a good time to, to start growing these. And you know during the summer sometimes because the sunlight and the warm weather does help out a lot with it. But so that's your basic steps in growing garlic. And I hope it works out for you and you get some really good garlic cloves. And this is Garrison signing out.